Hello there. I am actually in Burke Burnett's and uh, visiting, visiting my father. Uh, so, anyways, I've been looking, looking, and looking for something to share with you. And I think I finally found something that kind of started to go in one direction. But I, um, uh, yes, there's Nisi. Um, I, um, but it turns out that guy was selling me something else than what I was looking for. So I'm going to read it and, sh and share it to you what I feel God's telling me about this verse. It's in Judges 6, and it's verses 14 through 16. So I'm going to go ahead and read it. The Lord looked at him and said, Go in this your strength and deliver Israel from the hand of the Midian. I have, have I not sent you? He said to him, O Lord, how shall I deliver Israel? Behold, my family is the least in Manasseh, and I am the youngest in my father's house. But the Lord said to him, Surely I will be with you, and you shall defeat Midian as one man. So, I'll be honest with you, I've been trying to make a connection with family with the scripture, but what the Lord's actually, he led me to this scripture, and I couldn't find a connection, and then all of a sudden it just dawned on me. Uh, it's it's about family in a way, but it's more about how God doesn't care who you are. If he calls you to do something, uh, and you obey, you will get it done. It doesn't matter if you're rich, strong, powerful, or if you're a lowly, you know, person who might be down on this luck living... You know, living on the streets. If God has a plan for you to do something major, if you believe it and trust and trust in Him and obey Him, you will deliver God's plan because God's plan will not fail. It never fails. He always does what He says He's going to do. So don't let your family status or your social status or Whatever, don't let any kind of cultural status, there you go, determine what you can or cannot do. If God calls you to do something, just have faith, obey, and do it. And God will take care of you. So, I hope that gives somebody some encouragement today. And um, we love you guys. And when I say we, because you saw Nisi. Come on. God bless. So, God bless you. We love you. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.